Dear friends, welcome to Destination IS Academy. For any query or for any doubt, you can call us on the given number or you can visit our institute 639 first floor dr mukherjee nagar so dear friends today i will discuss about the following aspect under current affairs this topic is related to 24 october 2022 so this topic is tropical cyclone sitrang tropical cyclone sitrang in hindi ushan kati bandhiye chakravat so let us discuss about the tropical cyclone sitrang what it is so cyclone sitrang was a tropical cyclone that affected india and bangladesh on 25 october 2022 it was the first cyclone to hit bangladesh in cyclone mora in 2017 formed on 22 october offshore andaman and nicobar islands it gradually intensified and peaked as a high end cyclonic storm before making landfall over bangladesh close to barisal by the early hours of 25 october now come to the topic tropical cyclone sitrang imd officials imd stands for india meteorological department india meteorological department official said the first tropical cyclone uh, first tropical cyclone cyclone means in meteorology a cyclone is a large air mass that rotates around a strong center of low atmospheric pressure counter clockwise in the northern hemisphere and clockwise in the southern hemisphere as viewed from above cyclones are characterized by inward from inward spiraling winds that are rotate about a zone of low pressure so what is cyclone in meteorology a cyclone is a large air mass that rotates around a strong center of low atmospheric pressure counter clockwise in the northern hemisphere and clockwise in the southern hemisphere as viewed from above cyclones are characterized by inward spiraling winds that rotate about a zone of low pressure understood any problem if you have any problem then you can comment me and ask me question okay if you understand then well done now we were discussing imd official said that first tropical cyclone of the post monsoon now what is post monsoon in geography you have heard after uh, monsoon retreating monsoon or you can say post monsoon winds spill across the himalayas and flow to the southwest across the country resulting in clear sunny skies that is known as post monsoon so uh, post monsoon season of 2022 is likely to form in the bay of bengal it started from bay of bengal so while storms in october after the withdrawal of the southwest monsoon there is a rise in ocean heating which leads to rise in sea surface temperatures over the bay of bengal the atmospheric uh, moisture availability over the ocean too is higher when remnant system so what is remnant system remnant system means a tropical cyclonic degen rating into a trough or wave lacks a um, cyclonic circulation is referred as remnants okay so this is a remnant system so from south china sea reach the bay of bengal they had conducive conditions conducive condition means risk factors that increases the potential for a building to be attacked by the termites so conducive conditions is likely to be that so conducive conditions aiding the formation aiding english word in aiding uh, means to help something okay so aiding the formation means to help something uh, aiding the formation and intensification intensification of cyclone here um, intensification of cyclone means an increase in the maximum sustained winds of a tropical cyclone of at least 30 knots in a 24 hour period so this is intensification of cyclones in october now come to the topic cyclone sitrang the name sitrang has been given by thailand and features in the list of tropical cyclones name prepared by r s m c RSMC stands for Regional Specialized Meteorological Center. Regional Specialized Meteorological Center. Okay, so states likely to be affected by it. Gale winds. In English um, literature, you have read so many stories. Um, here a word used, gale winds. So gale winds means 
very strong winds gale winds are strong winds and enhanced rainfall are expected mainly over andaman and nicobar island odisha west bengal and bangladesh particularly the coastal district coast uh, cyclones in arabian sea in comparison to bay of bengal only 32 storms have developed in the arabian sea on october since 1891 in indian ocean the number is 61 tropical cyclone so tropical cyclone a tropical cyclone is a rapidly rotating storm system characterized by a low pressure center a closed low level atmospheric circulation strong winds and a spiral arrangement of thunderstorms that produce heavy rain and squalls squalls means a sudden storm with strong winds that is known as squalls that is known as squalls depending on its location and strength a tropical cyclone is referred to by different names including hurricane hurricane means Uh, a hurricane is a strong tropical cyclone that occurs in the atlantic ocean hurricane is a strong tropical cyclone that occurs in the atlantic ocean typhoon uh, typhoon is a mature tropical cyclone that develops between 180 degree and 100 degree east in the northern hemisphere typhoon is a mature tropical cyclone that develops between 180 degree and 100 degree east in the northern hemisphere after that hurricane typhoon tropical storm as i have already uh, told you tropical storm uh, tropical storm a system of winds that are rotating inwards to an area of low barometric pressure that is a cyclonic storm cyclonic storm is a, a system of winds that are rotating inwards to an area of low barometric pressure and tropical storm is uh, tropical storm is a storm when the ocean surface waters reaches at least 27 degree due to solar heating the warm air above the water rises quaking or casting an area of very low uh, very low pressure that is a tropical storm when the ocean surface water reaches at least 27 degree due to solar heating the warm air above the water rises quickly causing an area of very low atmospheric pressure okay so this is tropical storm and cyclonic storm a system of winds that are rotating inwards to an area of low barometric pressure that is known as cyclonic storm so here confusion was created now tropical depression tropical depression forms when a low pressure area is accompanied by thunderstorms that produce a circular wind flow with maximum sustained winds below 39 mph that is known as tropical depression or you can say simply cyclone so this is all about today's topic thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video then please do hit the like button and share this video and subscribe our channel thank you so much again and have a nice day